special. Yeah, the sound of love shadow. The reason. All free music, all the time. Pack stereo. TV. The sight and sound of body heat. Yeah. Love Shadow. You know you can go get the song for free at day.ccmixter.org. Go get it for free right now. Tell them Pac Stereo sent you. Yeah, we love it. <laughs> yeah. Uh, hey. Yeah, come on. It reminds me of a group I can't put my name uh, with the music yet, but I'm going to figure it out. Man, I love that, man. Yeah. Wow. All right, you guys. Welcome, welcome to part three. This is the final part of a wonderful series on producing, planning, having your own personal event at your house. <coughs> Excuse me. Those allergies, Vic. Oh, man. It's that California. It's that time of the year to take the Oh, it's truth. blossoming. It's, oh. it's coming. It's everywhere, bro. I'm telling you. But anyway, we're talking about having an event. And you're going to have this event at your house initially. And remember, Vic asked me about this. You know, we, he asked me about this because we had to go again and say what we're doing and summarize it. We're talking about having an event at your house, but you can scale it up. But remember, we want you to focus on the process. And the process is all about having an event that's a live performance recording that you're going to do. And then later on, it's going to be available for sale. DVD and CD. It's going to be on TuneCore or CD Baby, available on the internet. It's going to be for sale, download, on demand. You're going to have it at your house, and we're going to talk about the process. And remember, we said the idea is to scale it. You can scale it up. Now, Vic asked me. Vic said, "Well, why just you know so little, so small? Yep. And maybe even you said once or twice a year." Well, it doesn't necessarily have to be once or twice a year. I want you to ease into this because I think that this is a way of doing it from now on. Well, yeah, and you're right. You're right about that because it's it's one of those things where I think everybody wants to always scale up. They always want to take on more. And I understand that it's very important to have the process because when you do the process, it's easy to scale up from the process once you get used to it. So I understand that. Well, because I want you to focus. I want you to have fun with the first one. That's why I said the first one. I would prefer if you do the whole process, the same process that be, can be done for two to three hundred people, can be done for four to eight people. I prefer you do it the whole process for the small group the first time because I want you to have fun and I want you to enjoy it and being in control. I want you to do the whole thing. We talked about being on Evite where you can set up the event, send out the list from there. Promoted from there. We talked about product CDs being done at Disc Factory. We talked about merchandise. These are all plus or minuses. Four imprint, Queensboro, iPrint, Zazzle, cards, t shirts, hats, yep. thingies. Yeah, whatever. We talked about all the prep work, going to Tube Mogul, setting up the account, a YouTube, Twitter, Facebook account mandatory. Okay? All right. So it's time to do some shopping. All right, then. Everybody likes to spend money, right? Or is that... I hope so. Or spend less. If they spend, they want to feel like they're spending and get their worthwhile. So we can't wait to hear this information you're about to impart on us here, man. Well, first of all, we're good. I got to tell you, Vic, this is a machine that we love, right? Right. It's actually the newer model of a piece that you will recognize. Right. This is an outboard DVD recorder. Now, there are other things you can use. You can use hard disk recorders. Because, look, some people don't like it because it's limited in scope. But what we what, what do we like about it? Simple to use. Right. Take it everywhere. Right. We use it as our backup system. Yep. When we're live doing these shows, we're doing a live capture of the video to hard drive. You could do that live, too. Right. But what's good about these is that they record right to disk. Now, I actually like... Recording the videotape even better live because if it gets unplugged, wherever the tape stopped, right, the recording's there. 
but nobody has that today. Yeah, and, and you know, you have to kind of think of it. <laughs> how often, you know, you always say, you know, how often will you run into those positions? And I think you ran into it once in your entirety of how many years? You now? only have to have it happen once. <laughs> I was right. doing a live recording at a club. I had a digital VCR recording to tape. I had a direct, I had also had a machine recording a DVD disc live. Right. And then I had a regular backup VCR, just a regular stereo VCR. Right. But the other one was a digital VCR. Okay, so the power got knocked out or whatever at the club. And so at that point, the disc crashed. That right. was useless. Right. Okay? Yeah, I remember. The recording to hard drive crashed. It was useless. Right. Okay? But on both the videotapes, whatever the time the power went out, right. the stuff was there. Right. So I think if it's really important that you should have a regular VHS stereo deck tape or whatever you want that's tape as a backup if it's a really important. But if you don't, I just, you know, since you brought it up. Yeah, I got you. But for most of you, this will be enough. This machine is $200. It says two, you can find it like a Best Buy for $199. Mm, come down a little bit. Yeah, and you plug in to now. What we what do we say? How do you use this? You're going to take this machine, and you're going to plug. See there, and take a look at the side. You're going to plug your the audio from your little mixer into the audio inputs on this machine, and you're going to plug the video out from your camera into this machine. So the machine's going to be recording the video from your camera, or the audio from your mixer. And remember, we told you that even with the mixers we're talking about, you'll be able to mix, somebody will be able to mix even the, the crowd right. with your recording. That's correct. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Sorry about my cough. I have just these allergies today. Yeah, it's creeping, man. You know how it is. Well, excuse me, you guys. But anyway, this I love these because they're so simple to use. They also have card readers and all this other stuff. Hey, for $200, you got it. You got to at least use it as a backup. Like we do here at the studio, okay? So two hundred bucks. Now, if you have other stuff to record at your house, use that. Remember, you guys. By the way, I'm talking as if you don't own a home stereo, but I've said over and over and over again, if you have a good home stereo system, or even not so good, let's plan on using that for the party. Your big TV, whatever stereo system you have, you can even take the stereo system off your computer and move it into the living room. Okay, uh, because you're gonna even when you do your mon. See, if you do this performance right, you're gonna need monitors for you to hear yourself, right? Or and for the audience, even though you could also use headphones or earbuds. So remember, you can use the inexpensive music systems if in your house and home. Those you have bigger systems, you can move stuff around. Okay, but this piece and you. So if you have a recording system at home that records right to disc or any of that stuff. Feel free to use that. This is just a piece we like, okay? Yep. 200 bucks, okay? Now, let's do some shopping. I love to shop at Musicians Friends. I love to shop. I get stuff. I love to shop at Musicians Friends. So I give them that recommendation that I love to shop over there. So I do. I shop at them. That's why I mostly go. I, even though I do a lot of other places, too. Amazon a lot, too. But I'm, what we're going to do is we're going to pick the stuff that you need for this event, Okay. Now, we, we say you have a home stereo. We said you, we're going to be able to use that, whatever speakers you have, whatever amplifier, receiver. We can use all of that, okay?